So I'm gonna try this again. I tried doing a Facebook Live, but it didn't work. I'm too far back in the woods. I'm at uh, Copper Falls State Park, way up in uh, northern Wisconsin by winter. And uh, out here on a uh, summer camp trip. And uh, decided to go out and do some trail walking and came across uh, um, part of the map that shows you uh, um, walking backpacks to some trails and you go camping back in there with probably some scout leaders or things like that. Anyways, so I decided to take that nice little nature walk and kept walking. I'm like, okay, all of a sudden there was just, uh, there's no campsite and I just keep walking and I keep walking. Apparently I must have missed my turn. Uh, I finally got some internet way back up in here in the hills somewhere and I uh, Google mapped it <laughs> and I'm I'm a long ways away from where it need to be. Uh, needless to say I don't have any bug spray. The bugs are really really bad by the way. Um, I think I'm the only crazy one to come out this far. Oh, it's very hot. Very hot. Let's see. I turned around at 1220. It's now 1224. I'm kind of curious how long this is going to take to get back. Um, uh, kind of muddy in spots. <laughs> um, I guess I like to do this at least once a year, I guess. Get stuck in some muddy trails. <laughs> I don't know why, but uh, guess what it is. Anyways, uh, just record some of this and I'll post it later. Whether you guys want to watch most of it or part of it or fast forward, I'll kind of keep going through different spots of uh, the trails here. I gotta pay attention when I'm talking, though. I'm not talking when I'm walking, because <laughs> uh, there's a lot of, a lot of mud back there. Um, and I'll spin the camera around a few times here, just so you can kinda see the uh, trail I'm trying to walk through and get by the mud. Oh, it's so hot. The breeze is good, the sun's out. It's not that it's hot, hot, I'm hot. I've been running through the woods for an hour and a half and I have to be back to get on that bus <laughs> and drive a three hour tour back. A three hour tour. Yeah, I don't have Skip or Gilligan with me, but Gilligan would have been fun to joke with this whole way. Oh, I've been tripping him over some twigs and leaves or something. All right, I'm gonna flip it around here. I don't know if I can figure that out somehow. I guess I don't even know how to figure that out. Oh, I took a picture. Well, that sucks. Well, I guess I'll... Um, I'll just hold it the opposite direction. And you guys can hear me and you kind of see where I'm going. There's supposed to be some really nice ledges down here. Uh, some fishing spots. Some really cool rock designs of some sort. I don't know. Like I said, it's the first time I've been out here and I apparently took the wrong trail. <laughs> uh, there's a couple trails that go off, but I just keep following the blue marker. Figured the blue marker has got to get me to the end. Uh, if you go out on some state trails, please find a ranger or somebody and ask them if the dotted line ends. Uh, does that mean the the trail ends there or does it keep going? You just don't have information from that point on. And it's kind of go as you please because I just kept following the blue drills. That's all muddy. Oh shoot, I forgot about these spots up here. It's a lot of water. Ah, uh, shoot. Anyways, keep going. I hope I don't get poison ivy or something out of this crap. Or ticks. I have no idea. There's just too much crap back here. The bugs are horrible. And I ran into a couple of bear prints. And I hope I don't see a bear. Because... Uh, um, I can't say I can't outrun the bear. But I don't think I'm going to outrun them today. <laughs> I think I'm bear meat. <laughs> uh, this is kind of tiring now. <sighs> I was smart enough to bring along a little bit of water to drink. So I've been kind of sipping here and there, uh, thinking, you know, what happens if you do <laughs> get lost and you can't get any internet service? And you need to have something to sip on for a while. 
So kids, if you leave home for a long time, at least bring a little something to drink. It helps. Oh, I really wish there was markers back here. I mean, I'll show you. There's blue markers. Here's a blue marker right there. See right there. And that's uh, how I know I'm on the trail. But other than that, that's all I know. But I must have missed a trail somewhere because I don't know where that backpack camp is because I, I went way past that a long time ago. Sweating like crazy. I've been huffing and these trails for a while. Jumping these mud piles and uh, actually running through the woods. Uh, but I found this guy along the way. His name is Nobody. Meet Nobody. Yeah, that's Nobody. He's kind of shy. <laughs> nobody, you want to say something? Come on, don't be shy to the camera. Just say something. Another blue one right here. Uh, he's still shy. He's only said a couple words to me. Couldn't understand it. Told him to repeat himself, but I couldn't hear it. <sighs> It'd been nice to have someone to talk to this far back. I did run into uh, one couple back here with some fishing poles and bait and asked them if they had any luck. But that was probably 45 minutes ago when I first started this track. And I guess I should have asked them uh, how far it goes. Maybe they could have given me some tips on how far I need to go. Oh, it is now 12.30, so I started turning around 10 minutes ago. This could be a long ways. I'm absolutely tired. You know, and the worst is when you're back here by yourself. All you hear is twigs breaking and noises, and you keep looking, and I you know, just hope it's nothing. I mean, if it's a moose, so I'd rather have a moose see me than a bear, of course, because I don't think a moose is going to try to eat me. And this whole area up here in the North Country here has got all kinds of moose. Um, Highway Double G has moose all over up here. But I tell you what, if you ever travel it, don't break down because there's like no houses around for miles. <sighs> These bugs are killing me. <sighs> you guys are probably not going to want to watch, get off me, bug, this whole thing, but you know. If you do, you can fast forward at times. I'm kind of curious how long it's going to take me to get back, really. Uh, oh boy. The sun's bright up there. Thank God I got some shade, but I do need these, uh, need these trees to unshadow some of it so it can dry up. Fortunately, be too late for me to do that because I'm already covered in mud all over. <sighs> There's a couple of interesting uh, trail paths out here. Uh, some valleys. Oh, tell you what, there's no bathrooms out here, nowhere. So, uh, if you got to go number two, put some napkins in your pocket if you got to because it's a long hike. Very long hike. Oh. And I actually tried to do this Facebook Live when I first started. Of course, I knew I was going to run out of service, so I did. All right, I'm going to flip it around again. You guys can kind of see coming out on these paths here. I'm way up in the valley here. Look at that view. Oh, that view is amazing. I want to go all the way down there and I water. I was kind of hoping where I was going to end up, but I took the wrong path. Oh, another blue marker. <sighs> not saying I have to, but I really gotta start huffing here soon because I gotta I gotta be back in an hour so I can rest to drive. And there's still some more falls I wanna hit. So I'm gonna I'm gonna boogity 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 <sighs> a little bit here. Go through these trails. Oh. Uh, yeah. uh, my running partner here. How you doing? You're not tired, but I am. I'm doing all the running. You're just sitting here watching the screen. And joining this video here. Oh. I'm probably going to have a booster or two on here as well. Ooh, jump the mud. Ooh. Okay. There we go. Here we go. Oh. Oh. 
Oh man, this is a hike beyond hike. I was gonna turn back. I was gonna turn back literally half hour ago. Even though it's only been 10 minutes. Okay, maybe 40 minutes ago. I thought I had to be going too damn far. Way too far. And I don't know how to mark it. Except it was far. Here's my trail again. Camera might be a little shaky. Listen, I, I don't have a stabilizer with me at this moment in time to stop the shaky. Holy cow. Man. See, way down there. On the side of the cliff here. Boom. Back to the trail. There's my blue marker again. So I know where I'm at. Kinda. Starting to get out of breath again. These uphills are the toughest. Yeah. Here's my trail. My blue marker. I think I'm going to email them and tell them I have to mark those blue trees like every quarter mile or something. So you know how far you went. I know I've gone, I've gone way too far. Way too far to be out in this. Oh, I found this one sign back here. It says, you're on a hiking trail. And that's all they want on this trail, just for hiking. But that's the only information I got. Oh, I was disappointed. I thought I finally made it to the end. Oh, yep, I heard something running back there in the trees again. Oh. I got some mud around this bend, I remember. I remember having to crawl through that stuff a little bit. You know, and I hear voices, I'm like, I hear somebody, but there's no one. There's a sign. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There it is. Yeah. Yeah, that's a sign. But I swear I hear voices somewhere. You know, like a gotta be up someone else talking besides me. In the big state park, there's a lot of people parked here on a Tuesday just camping. <sighs> See. 16 minutes I've been on this trail heading back. And I've only stopped once and I was back there for one second to show you that sign. Other than that, I jogged a little bit. I've been walking at a decent pace. Uh, like Adam Sandler would say, in and out at a medium pace. Uh, he'd, be, he'd be sitting there laughing his ass off right now. He should make a movie have Rob Schneider think he's the star of this movie <laughs> he takes place in his backwoods here and they're gonna put a body cam on him make him walk all the way back here kind of like Blair Rich Project <sighs> that'd be kind of funny huh and then have uh, some weather scan set up and some things making sounds along the way and you know give him some line of bull crap <laughs> And uh, try to scare the crap out of him making the movie. I don't know if he would or not because he's probably had a lot of pranks pulled on him. <sighs> okay. I'm going to turn this uh, camera around again and I'm going to start running again and try to catch up on some of the space here. Whew. Blue marker. Keep on going. Keep on going around the bend. Can you see me now? 
I'm running. I really am running. It's not very fast. Fast enough to get me there. Oh, watch out for that tree. Oh. <laughs> Man, I'm not gonna lie, I went a little too far. Damn, these are fucking shit. I had to take my keys off my belt. I'm getting stuck. I'm jangling out. Okay, you need two hands to do this, don't you? Get out of here, bug. Here, keys. They drive me nuts. I put them in my back pocket. Okay, I'm on again. Here we go. Oh, yeah. I wish I had some hops like Peter. I'm tired. I've been walking all day. I'm running part of the day. Hand says hi. Left hand says hi. Feet say they're tired. They can't tie. They're, they're tired. I'm tired. Bucks. Bucks are horrible. Oh man, I got a long ways to go. I just know I do. There's so many markers in my mind that I ran past. I didn't even reach one of them yet. Okay. Try to run again a little bit more. I gotta try to speed this process up a little bit somehow. Somehow. Oh yeah. Okay. Across the rocks. I finally met these. that valley at oh shoot I forgot it came through this mud pile <sighs> oh. Oh. you know when you go hiking you bring a stick backpack extra things in your backpack not as in just try to walk <sighs> with nothing but your phone and try to get a yeah, mud puddle again. Another marker. Doesn't tell you how far it is though. Need to get a drink again. I did a left, right, left. I think country guys do that. Left, right, left, huh, hitch, something. I don't know. I don't really listen to country music. So. It's gotta be a country song in there somewhere. I guess you call someone like, I don't know. What's his name? 
Travis Stritt, he's an older guy. Huh? He had been partying in the woods a few times. God dang, these bugs are horrible. Oh, oh man. Okay. I left at 20 after it's now 12.43. So I'm 23 minutes in. And I don't think I'm even halfway back. Which is not good. Because we are leaving in about an hour and 17 minutes. That means I'm not going to get all the good pictures of the falls and stuff that I wanted. Because I took the longest, wrongest trail a long time ago. This video has been recording now for 20 minutes. Oh. Okay. Okay, I got to pick up the pace again. Go, oh, fuck. Sorry, I swear again. I got about a, a minute. I have to slow down again. I just got too tired. Here. Way down there. Way down there. You can't see it. But it's ways down there. Here comes a little opening up here. Some cliffs you can see a little bit. I got this gully, I gotta go all the way down and get all the way back up. Oh. Oh. Here's a blue paint spot again. Oh, oh man. Oh, I'm exhausted. Oh, I'm very sweaty too. Yeah. Down there. Way down there, there's a valley with the river in it, the creek, whatever. I wasted another minute walking. Oh, I didn't even hit that valley, I thought this was a valley. I got this all the way back up again. Oh, yeah. You know, uh, I wish I trained with Forrest Gump because that guy could just run forever. <sighs> you know, he never get tired. He just keep running and running for no good reason, but it just felt like running. Oh, yeah. You remember that point? Hey, man, what are you doing this? I don't know. I just like running. Really, man? Oh, cool. Can I get your autograph? And then he jumps like a splash. Oh. And he steps in a big pile of shit. And he takes it, and right off he goes, oh, oh, you just ran through a big pile of shit. And he said, it happened. What? Shit, it happened. And then, boom, next you know, shit happens. Comes a t-shirt, bumper stickers, you know. It's all made believe, but that's how they put it in the movie, similar. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, 25 minutes in, and I don't think I'm halfway back. It's not good. Okay, I had to get up this little point here and start jogging again. Oh, this is not good. Holy cow, these bugs are getting me again. Man. Uh, I wish I could close this down and keep it open so I could check and see where I'm at on the map if I got signal. I got it out here a couple times. Made one phone call. 
I don't know how you get no signal inside the park. You start walking a mile back into the woods, all of a sudden you got signal. I don't understand it. And that's what I did when I first started. I like, oh, I got signal again. Let's try Facebook Live. It didn't work. I'm pretty sure I mentioned that already three times. <sighs> okay. We're going to go around this bend. Oh, I got to pick up the pace. Another one of my blue markers. Uh. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh my god. I got a long ways to go. No markings. I'll tell you how far you are. You just gone. Uh, a little bit of a washout here. Uh, oh. uh, huh. It's now 12.50. Been running for half an hour. Oh. Oh, it's not good. I got a long ways to go. I can remember not even half the spots I missed yet. Oh man. Okay. There's a fork in the road. I remember hitting this. There's a slight trail that went the other way, and, and I'm thinking must be we're bare and deep. Uh, Deer and uh, there's a trail over there. Nothing marks it. I don't know what it is. Something walking through there because it ain't like this trail. Come on. Oh, I don't know. I mean, they could have created that trail, and there's only certain people that know where it goes. But I'm saying on the one that I was on before. Uh, these blue tree markers and these bugs. Uh, Oh, mud. Okay, pick up the pace. Come on, pick up the pace again. Oh, my feet are gonna have blisters tomorrow. Oh man, I haven't even hit this valley yet. Oh, those are. I just saw some hoof prints back there. I didn't see those on the way over here. That's mud. Hey, there's something right there. It's like hooves. I don't. I don't remember seeing those before. Some more. I don't know if you saw them or not, but I can see those. Ah, oh, dang it! Oh, man. I should have recorded the video earlier because when I first started this, I walked around the regular route where all the, you know, visitors go. And they got all these waterfalls. You can walk out there. Oh, man. They got some walk-offs there so you can take some good pictures. I'll post them online. I didn't get all of them because I kind of detoured off. Oh, I think I got a blister on my left foot. Starting to hurt. Oh. So I've been recording this video now. Oh, 30 minutes. Been on the run for uh, 33. Hmm. Oh, man. I'm tired. 
I am extremely tired. I know I got a ways to go. There's one valley I haven't even hit yet. It's down. Oh. That might have been a halfway point, crying out loud. Hmm. I can honestly say, if I ever come back to this park again, definitely not taking this trail again. Maybe to that one point where I guess I missed a trail, there was a sign there, but the sign looked like backpacking was this way and camping was this way. And there's like this, someone made their own path to the left, and that must have been the path I needed to go on. But to me, it looked like I was supposed to be on. I don't know about you guys, I'm exhausted. You're probably bored watching this thing when you're watching it. And skipping through fast forward. Mm. 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 Oh, there's a little trail out here. Goes out. There's a washout right there. It goes all the way down that valley. You see that? Pretty good washout on that side of the hill. I don't know how long it's been there, but. Oh man, I'm exhausted and my feet hurt. I'm really curious how long it's gonna take me to get back. I mean, it's five to one. <laughs> 